All right, so I just uh, rode the 2018 Hornet, and now it's time to test X-Blade. That's a gear position indicator. It sounds similar, um, it sounds similar to the Hornet or the Unicorn 160. Um, I like this uh, instrument console, it looks better than the one on Hornet. It looks a lot sharper. Alright, let's continue for a spin. Yes, I'm gonna be riding this uh, within the city, so I won't be able to do a top speed run or a 0 to 100, but I'll try to do a 0 to 60. And you know what, I'm impressed with this bike. Uh, the, the bottom end on this bike is actually much uh, better than that of uh, Hornet. Riding this bike, it reminds me of. Uh, yeah, the, the bottom end is similar to that of Jigsaw. Not as strong as Jigsaw, but it's got a really good uh, bottom end. It's just so easy to maneuver in the traffic. I can say the bottom end is similar to Unicorn uh, 160. A little better than Hornet, but not as good as Jigsaw. But you know, despite being uh, 140 kgs, this bike is uh, easier to flick around in traffic. The brakes are okay, not so great. This one has a drum unit at the rear. The engine is uh, butter smooth, it's, it's really smooth, no vibes uh, whatsoever. And it sounds exactly like a unicorn or a helmet. Uh, those of you people who need a city bike, uh, I think this is a good option. It actually looks uh, fresher. It's a lot more easy to look around in traffic. And I think the gear ratios are... Uh, I think it's on the solar side. Let me see... What thing doesn't... Let's get 5,000 up here. Yeah, it's exactly the same as on it. It is about uh, 55 km per hour at uh, 4,000 RPM in this year.